Hello. 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 Welcome to third grade and parents and teachers. We're so glad that you're here. This is a brand new thing that's happening for third grade this year. We have never before had a TED Ed Club for third graders. And so I'm very, very excited for these seven students to get to share with you. Here we 
weird. You're dumb. You're strange. Your clothes are ugly. Ew, why does she look like that? Is that a boy or a girl? You're different than I am. How would you feel if that was you? Raise your hand if you would feel bad if you heard things like that said about you. Now think if you've ever said something like that about someone else. Or maybe you didn't say it, but did you ever think about it? See, we all do it. Everybody does it. We judge because we're human. Look at this picture. What do you think is wrong? based on their first impressions, just because of what someone looks like. For example, if you walk with a book, someone might say, well, they're a library mouse, but I'm also a library mouse. I'll go talk to them. But another person might be rude and say, hey, nerd. Or if you see someone walking with a cool jacket, someone might be like, wow, they're cool. Another person might be jealous and say, Wow, really People mostly judge because they're jealous. Jealousy is a whole other topic. But you shouldn't judge people just because they're jealous. You, 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 and you are a <coughs> Now let's talk about how the other person feels. When people are judged, they feel discriminated, isolated, criticized, and misunderstood, and they're afraid to talk to an adult, like Ms. Batista. Quote that says, Don't read your book by its cover to you. Read the book. I love this quote because it tells you to first read their book, the story of who they are. Get to know them, be get to know them before you judge that person. Also, even after you get to know someone, if they don't come out as you want, don't say one story about them. That just starts to be in you. I have a friend that calls me skinny. Thin arms, that doesn't mean I am weak. I tell my friends, my friend, that I am stronger than what I than how I look. See, this is the problem with people. We keep on judging each other and labeling one another without thinking about how it makes the other person feel. We need more empathy. Here's a tip that helps me to stop judging. I tell myself that I am enough. We're all different. Some of us have more and some of us have less. But why don't they more enough? Be 
being a friend. Oh, being generous and considerate. Now, these are some examples of where some mean kindness. Some where some mean kindness are Google, affection, warmth, gentleness, tenderness, concern, and more. So now you know that you should always be kind with your friends. And remember, <laughs> be a body, not a bully. Thank you.
but some people are different. The oceans are on Earth are getting higher because um, greenhouse gases are affecting that. And once the greenhouse gases gas, gases go to the atmosphere, then all then the sun will get hotter, and and the sun gets hotter, so the ocean rises, and that's why islands are disappearing fast. These are some animals that really struggle with climate change. Polar bears, polar bears struggle a lot with climate change because it is affecting the weather. Climate change mostly brings hot weather in the in the in the weather. So polar bears habitat is a cold icy climate and the hot sweaty sun and climate change affect the polar bears habitat because the icy habitat melts and they won't have somewhere to live.